CBSE Science Class 10 Chapter 3 Metals and Nonmetals Part 2A Let us learn the chemistry chapters through questions and answers, which most of the students prefer. Note that, PG here is for page, PR for paragraph in your textbook, and questions are in yellow color while answers are in white color. Which of the following methods is suitable for preventing an iron frying pan from rusting? A. Applying grease. B. Applying paint. C. Applying a coating of zinc. D. All the above. Answer. C. Applying a coating of zinc, which is also called galvanizing. An element reacts with oxygen to give a compound with high melting point. This compound is also water soluble. The element is likely to be A. Calcium B. Carbon C. Silicon D. Iron Answer A. Calcium Note that calcium reacts with oxygen to form calcium oxide. Food cans are coated with tin and not with zinc because a. Zinc is costlier than tin, b. Zinc has higher melting point than tin, c. Zinc is more reactive than tin, d. Zinc is less reactive than tin. Answer, c. Zinc is more reactive than tin. You are given a hammer, a battery, a bulb, wires and a switch, A. How could you use them to distinguish between samples of metals and non-metals? With the help of a hammer, convert both the metal arid non-metal solid into plates or rods. Metal will readily form these since they are malleable. Non-metals being brittle will break when struck with hammer. Now construct a cell in both the cases using these plates as electrodes and switch on the current. If the bulb glows, this means that the electrodes are of metals. In case it does not glow, it means that the electrodes are of non-metals. You are given a hammer, a battery, a bulb, wires and a switch, B. Assess the usefulness of these tests to distinguish between metals and non-metals. From these tests, we conclude that, metals are malleable while non-metals are not. Metals are good conductors of electricity while non-metals are not. Graphite is an exception. What are amphoteric oxides? Give examples of two amphoteric oxides. These are oxides that can act both as acid and base. For example, aluminium oxide Al2O3 and zinc oxide ZnO. The amphoteric character of zinc oxide is shown by the following reactions. Name two metals which can displace hydrogen from dilute acids and two metals which cannot do so. Sodium and calcium can displace hydrogen from dilute acids. Copper and silver cannot displace hydrogen from dilute acids. Note that metals above hydrogen in the activity series can displace hydrogen from dilute acids. In the electrolytic refining of metal M, name anode, cathode and electrolyte. Anode, rod of impure metal, cathode, rod of pure metal, electrolyte, aqueous solution of soluble salt of metal M. Note, in this experiment for copper, 
anodism pure copper cathode is a strip of pure copper electrolyte is solution of acidified copper sulfate